क्लास एट्थ सब्जेक्ट जनरल साइंस चैप्टर फिफ्टीन साउंड एक्सरसाइज Question one: Fill in the blanks with appropriate words. A. The region in a sound wave with higher pressure and density is called compression, and that with low pressure and density is called rarefaction. B. Medium is needed for generation of sound. C the total number of compression and rarefaction produced per sound in a sound wave is 1000 the frequency of the sound wave is 500 hertz D different sound notes have different frequencies E in a loudspeaker mechanical energy is converted into sound energy question 2 give scientific reasons a it is essential to change the tension in the vocal cords as we produce different sound notes from our larynx answer different sound notes correspond to different frequencies The frequency of sound depends on the tension in the vocal cords hence it is essential to change the tension in the vocal cords as we produce different sound notes from our larynx B astronauts on the moon cannot hear each other directly answer two astronauts on the moon talking to each other directly will be unable to listen to each other even if they are very close to each other the moon does not have atmosphere since there is no medium which is necessary for generation and propagation of sound between the astronauts direct sound propagation between them is not possible therefore the astronauts use some technology like the one used in our cell phones to communicate with each other the waves used in cell phones do not need any medium for propagation c as the sound wave propagates from one place to other in air the air itself is not required to move from one place to other propagation of sound through air occur due to energy transfer by vibrating air molecules in one region to those in the adjacent region away from the source the molecules simply vibrate about their mean position hence the air itself is not required to move from one place to the other question 3 how are different sound notes generated in musical instruments like guitar which uses strings for sound generation and flute which uses blown air for sound generation answer 1 guitar it is a string based flat back instrument it has usually six strings the strings are plugged or strummed with the fingers or a small piece of plastic wood etc it has a flat sounding board with a circular sound hole in the center also it has a fretted fingerboard its frequency range is more than 3 octaves the frequency of vibration of the string is changed by 
changing the tension in the string or changing the vibrating length of the string as the tension is increased the frequency increases as the vibrating length is increased the frequency decreases this is how different sound notes are generated to flit it is a wind instrument where air is blown against the edge or rim of the blowing hole the frequency of the sound produced depends upon the length of the vibrating air column in the tube the greater the length of the vibrating air column the less is the frequency of the sound produced this is how different sound notes are produced the flute has six or seven or eight holes to generate sounds of different frequencies different notes can be generated also by changing the way of air blowing question 4 how is sound produced in the human larynx and a loudspeaker answer sound production in the human larynx in the humans sound is produced in the voice box called the larynx it is located at the upper end of wind pipe the focal cords are stretched across it with a narrow slit between them for the passage of air in figure 15.5 when the lungs force air through the slit the cords start vibrating the frequency of the sound produced depends upon the length and thickness of the cords and tension in the cords the frequency increase with the increase in tension and the more length of the thickness of the cord the less is the frequency muscles attached to the cords can make the cords tight or loose epiglottis means a flap that closes air track during swallowing vocal cords trachea esophagus to sound produced in a loudspeaker figure 15.6 shows the internal construction of a loudspeaker here a coil is wound around a permanent magnet the conical screen of the loudspeaker is attached to the coil when a current is passed through the coil a magnet field is produced its interaction with the permanent magnet results in the back and forth motion of the coil the frequency and the amplitude of the motion of the coil depends on the vibration in the current through the coil as the coil moves the conical screen also moves back and forth the vibrations of the screen produce sound waves in air very loud sound can be produced by changing the current permanent magnet screen coil from microphone question 5 explain the experiment with neat diagram to prove the following sound needs a material medium for propagation answer bell jar electric bell to vacuum pump figure 15.3 shows part of the setup used in this experiment what is not shown is the electric circuit in which the electric bell is connected a vacuum tight bell jar 
contains an electric bell connected to a power supply through the lid of the jar. The jar is placed on a smooth horizontal surface such as that of glass. Infinity the vacuum pump is off and the jar contains air. The circuit containing the bell is completed using the key or the switch so that the bell starts ringing. This can be heard outside the jar. Then the vacuum pump is switched on so that it starts removing the air from the jar. We find that the level of the ringing sound heard goes on decreasing as the quantity of the air in the jar becomes less and less. When the pump is operated for a sufficiently long time interval, the quantity of air in the jar becomes so less that the level of the ringing sound becomes very low. Sound is hardly audible, but we can see the streaker in the bell hitting the gong by extrapolation. We conclude that sound generation and propagation needs a medium. Question 6. Match the following. Human larynx. Vibration in vocal cords. Loudspeaker. Vibration of screen. Jal tarang. Vibrations in air column. Tuning fork. Vibration of metal arm. Sitar. Vibrations in strings. 